Hey family, I just wanted to share a quick tip. I was at the gym and I was thinking about um, something I wanted to share with you about your metabolism. So our bodies are constantly trying to do homeostasis, remain in balance. So they're adapting to whatever we're doing and creating a new normal. So if you're not using certain things, it doesn't replenish those cells. If you are, it makes more, um, depending on what you're doing, your lifestyle, and what you're putting into your body. So when you go to do exercising, if you haven't exercised in a while, you don't wanna go out and do like an hour of cardio right away, okay? Because then you're creating a standard where your body has to live up to, and then you'll have to get past that in order to get any type of um, increase, any type of effectiveness. So you don't wanna show all your cards all at once. So for me, if I don't do cardio for a while, if I'm doing like a lot of lifting and um, I haven't done cardio for a while, I'll start with 10 minutes. So I'll do 10 minutes of something uh, and I'll do intervals. So like 30 seconds high intensity and then 30 seconds low intensity. And I will keep that cycle up for 10 minutes. And then maybe the following week, I'll take it to 12 minutes and I might change the cycle from 30 seconds to 45 seconds. Then I might change the cycle from 45 seconds to a minute high intensity, a minute low intensity for 12 minutes and then increase it for 15 minutes and then increase it as you go. So this way you're getting the most out of every experience. So instead of going to an hour and then you have to maintain that and go past it, now I'm getting the most that I can out of that 10 minutes. 12 minutes so my metabolism is reaching to what my effort level is so if i want to boost my metabolism i won't always want to keep it working i want a high intensity interval training for that 10 minutes then 12 minutes i'm going to get the next level i'm going to get the next level i'm going to get it so that you are effective a lot of times we just want to gut things out i'm going to do it right away and i'm going to work long and i'm going to work hard doesn't necessarily mean that you're going to get the best benefits okay it's a good thing but it's not necessarily how your body works. It's just like teaching school. Somebody can hand in a paper that's well written and it's two, three pages long, but if the, you're not answering the question that I asked, still wrong. Well, it's the same type of thing. We gotta learn how our body works to get the most benefit from it. So that's just my suggestion for you. Take it or leave it. I would suggest start with 10 minutes, go do, do those intervals, vary the times for the intervals, and then increase your time as you go to get the most and so that you train your metabolism um, to always be active and running at a higher level. All right, let's go get moving.